Well, hello there. Welcome and thank you for listening. Welcome to another episode of Magical Stories by yours truly, Rhonda Del Baccio. I'm an author, speaker, psychic medium, artist, photographer, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. So today this is a little story snack, a 100-word story, and it's based on a photo prompt. And it was for Friday Fictioneers for 20th of April, 2020. So what happens with these, in case you're new, and thank you, by the way, if you're new or if you're returning, in either case, I appreciate you listening. Um, You can find all of these stories in this podcast on my blog, which is Magical Stories by Rhonda, R-O-N-D-A, at .wordpress.com. So there is no H in my name. Uh, And so with this story from a photo prompt, you don't need to see the picture to understand the story. It's uh, a decrepit looking damaged picture of Paris sitting kind of in a corner against a wall. There's uh, an oily looking floor, an outlet, a plastic tub. It just looks very derelict and unloved. Um, My story for you is uh, I thought of uh, when I, I had to actually ask the person who made the prompt, what exactly is that? Because I could not figure it out. And she said it was a picture of Paris. And I thought of the Notre Dame Cathedral and the burning spire. So my story is called Notre Dame Burning. Gazing at the glorious spire at La Cathedral de Notre Dame, My heart thumped. Such a treat for anyone who loves to visit historic sites. Inside, I bypassed the kiosks where guests can hear about the building and history of the site in any of a hundred languages. I wanted to feel and experience it for myself. Stepping into the sanctuary, I felt like a grain of sand on a beach. I heard the prayers of countless faithful and the voices of 10,000 choirs in my heart. Then fire reduced to ash in minutes, what took years to build. And I get a little for clumps thinking about that. And so, so that is my story, and I hope you enjoy it. You can... Read this story and others on the blog Magical Stories by R O N D A dot WordPress dot com. And also, you can link directly to this story through the show notes. I'm a best selling author with various books on Amazon and wherever you purchase books. And so, I hope that you will check that out and enjoy reading whatever it is that you get. I hope you'll also be kind enough to rate and review this podcast wherever it is you're listening. That is basically currency for us podcasters. We do not get money for this. We do this to entertain and to connect with people like you. And I do definitely look forward to connecting with you personally. So I thank you once again for listening. And also please subscribe and As always, cheers to your blissful life.